Download the firmware of the UAPAC Lite from their website. Usually, the firmware application requires Java. Try to install firmware if you are sure that your computer has already an updated Java version. Otherwise, follow the automatic link as shown to download and install. Once Java is installed successfully, install the firmware. Run or launch the Unify Network application after. Make sure that you have an Ubiquiti account. If none, you create your account as required. As shown, connect Unify APAC Lite device to the Gigabit PoE. On your active internet router, connect Gigabit LAN port to any available port in the router. Turn on the power of Gigabit PoE and launch the Unify APAC Lite application. Name your network application and tick the box for agreeing to the end user license agreement, click next. Enter the Ubiquiti account and password, click next. Enable auto backup as shown, click next. Tick the box and click Next. Assign a Wi-Fi name of your Unify APAC Lite and password. Enable combine 2 and 5 GHz Wi-Fi network names into one and click Next. Enter the Ubiquiti account and the Wi-Fi name assigned on the device and click Finish. Wait for the configuration to finish. Once installation of the firmware is done, the dashboard will be displayed as shown. Congratulations, you made it! Blue LED color of your Unify APAC light will indicate that the device has been successfully integrated into a network, and is working properly. You may put the device to the place where your network Wi-Fi is weak to extend the signal or coverage.